The outtakes for today's video comes to us courtesy of Maple Live Vancouver TV. You can find a link to their socials in the description below. Now let's get right into it. So what's your name? Kesha. Yeah. Where are you from? Punjab, India. What brought you to Canada? So I'm here for the studying and mostly for the PR life. Mm -hmm. That's everybody, every international student's dream. So Right off the bat, we've got a huge problem here. I mean, there was a time when people used to try covering up and they were breaking the law, but our dude here clearly does not give a damn. And that's part of the problem right there in terms of why gaming the system keeps happening. If you're seeing hundreds of people around you laughing it off, you eventually get the message that it's really not as serious a crime as it's made out to be. So in terms of future jobs that you would like to do after you graduate, what are you looking for? I'm an Andrew Tate fan, so jobs are for losers. Pardon? Oh my god, I swear to god, the first time I heard this clip, I actually thought this kid might be trolling the audience. I mean, if it wasn't so serious, it would actually be hilarious. You have no idea how I wish someone would ambush Mark Miller with this clip the next time he's holding a presser. The best, however, is the interviewer's reaction. Pardon? Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate. Yeah, the Romanian guy. The bald guy. Tell me why you want to be like Andrew Tate. Yes, young sir. Please do tell us why you want to be like Andrew Tate. And for that matter, be sure to repeat everything you say in this interview with your case officer the next time you guys meet. So watch this next part. The interviewer can't even be bothered to conceal her reaction. He says to escape the matrix. Matrix is like a bubble made by the government. Like just to be in there, to be slaves, they give you money to work for themselves 9 to 5. That's it. I, wa I want to get rich. Do you have any advice for anyone that's um, kind of wanting to come to Canada? Just don't come, go to another country. Like right now, Canada, the housing is too expensive. <laughs> I can say anything. <laughs> I think this is the only point I agree with him on. He is right. The cost of living is completely off the hook, but at the same time, you have to wonder why he picked Vancouver of all places. Rentals in Metro Vancouver are beyond unaffordable. I mean, did he not take the time before coming over to research rent rates across the country and pick a cheaper town or city to live in? Either way, well, there you have it. We have a severe shortage of doctors. We don't have nearly enough manpower to build the tens of millions of homes required to fix the housing crisis. But you know what? Those are people who work jobs. Doctors, being a doctor is a job. Working in construction, that's a job. And what we've learned today is that jobs are for losers. <laughs> this country is done. Once again, do check out Maple Life Vancouver's channel. Links are in the description. Thank you very much for watching. And if you haven't done so already, please do consider subscribing.